In this lab, we're going to be using two Erlenmeyer flasks, a graduated cylinder, magnesium shavings or magnesium turnings, and one molar hydrochloric acid, HCl. Also, we're going to need two balloons, a weigh boat, your electronic balance, a scupula, and possibly a funnel. You will be assigned a certain amount of magnesium and hydrochloric acid to add to your flasks. Once you're assigned that amount, you want to go ahead and pour them. For this experiment, we're going to be using 25 milliliters of hydrochloric acid in each flask. So we got flask A and flask B. I'm going to use a funnel to pour that. Okay, now that we have our two acid amounts, we'll set these over here, and then we're going to fill our balloons up with different amounts of the magnesium. So for the balloon A, we're gonna use about 0.15 grams. So I'll take my weigh boat, turn on my scale, my electronic balance, put my weigh boat on here, press tear to remove the weight of the weigh boat, and weigh out about 1.15 grams. Okay. All right, there we go. Give you a look at that. My mass ended up being about 0.18 grams, which is totally fine because we said somewhere near 0.15. We'll add that amount to balloon A. We'll use the green balloon for balloon A. And the easiest way to do this would be to pinch the weigh boat on the opposite corners. It makes a funnel. And then just go ahead and drop your magnesium into your balloon. Try not to lose any. Make sure the magnesium goes all the way down into the bigger part of the balloon. So we'll shake that. Okay, And then we'll lay it down on the table gently. And then we're gonna do the same thing for the second balloon, but we're gonna add a different amount of magnesium. We'll tear the mass. And for this one, we'll add about 0.30. So you can see it ended up being 0 0.36 grams, which looks about like that. At this point now, we are going to set up our two Erlenmeyer flasks with our balloons, and it helps if you have a lab partner to do this with, but I'm just going to gently roll the top of my balloon over while letting the rest of it hang. And the same thing with this, I'm gonna gently roll the top of my balloon over, careful not to break the balloon. And then at the same time, I'm going to release the magnesium into the hydrochloric acid for you to see. Also, when I touch the flask with the back of my hand, um, they're both very hot. Um, B is slightly hotter. Give you a slightly closer look. Good. And to kind of facilitate or make the reaction go faster, 
uh, you can go ahead and give it a swirl, but be very gentle. Um, you want to make sure your balloon stays on. So if you need to kind of hold down the top with your fingers, you can do that. Again, you can make the reaction go by faster by stirring, mixing, making more of the hydrochloric acid come into contact with the magnesium metal at a faster rate. 